Uh, thank you. I just wanted to say a couple things. I, I thank Dean for having this conference. Uh, I've been against Startup New York from the beginning. I have, have own a family business. My, our family business was started in 1946. Uh, we've, we're still surviving in New York, uh, but uh, the business climate in New York continues to decline, and in a business like ours, we do pharmaceutical packaging. I used to run a newspaper, uh, our newspaper division, which we sold. Uh, it's harder and harder to survive in New York, especially since our customer base is everywhere. We don't just serve local customers. We, can, we serve uh, customers who are international. Uh, we are competing against Canada, other states, Mexico in the, in the pharmaceutical packaging business. So when, a, when a, an idea like Startup New York comes along, basically what we're doing is saying we can start a competing business, as long as it's near or on a SUNY campus, against an existing New York business that's been here for we're over 70 years now, paying taxes, employing our employees, providing benefits and services, and yet we don't get any benefits like reduced taxes, reduced property taxes, relief from some of the <coughs> mandates, some of the seeker process in, in trying to expand our plants. So those are the types of things that we need for our small businesses. Many people don't realize that small business creates 65 percent of the new jobs, not the big fat cats that are coming in taking millions of dollars and you know, some people call it crony capitalism, cronyism, capitalism, whatever you want to call it. Startup New York is the poster child for that c concept, which is a failed policy for New York. We have to stop the bloodletting. We need to let New York businesses thrive again. And many of these businesses are very small businesses. We employ less than 70 now. At one point, we employed 80. Uh, the onerous burdens of being a small business owner in New York are not being addressed by a program like Startup New York. So I you know, urge my colleagues and I urge the governor to shut down Startup New York, take the millions and millions, hundreds of millions that have been spent, and give it back to our taxpaying businesses, reduce the taxes, reduce the regulations, make it easier for us to compete across state lines and across uh, country lines at this point. And uh, that's just, hopefully we'll take care of that soon. Thank you. Thank you, Claudia.